Lindsey Brown now for Denver. Wow, Whoa, what yes. a big double. <laughs> that was a double well from Barton Me. <laughs> Perfectly straight. You don't often see a double layup that straight in the air. Teddy Carr got a 9-8-3-7-5. So a 9-8 or more for Lindsey Brown here means Denver will move into a solid second place at the halfway point in this meet. I like this here, back one and a half, front layout into the Cisson. Very nice touch to that tumbling pass. Lindsey Brown, the sophomore from Kansas City, Missouri, did her club training at Gage Gymnastics. She had so many top level athletes competing in this NCAA championship group. This is a routine that has what it takes to to get that, really earn that big score. Open with a knee past the double layout and comes back, final pass with a pike double back. Nice high chest position at the end. Great routine. And a great rotation for Denver here in the second rotation of these national championship semifinals. They've come to count on Lindsey Brown and Maddie Carr all season long and they delivered in this rotation. Love to see this pass again. The position in the air is exquisite. Perfectly straight, like spinning a pencil around and almost keeps that front foot down. It slid back a little bit and that should be a slight deduction, but impressive nonetheless. The Pioneer Nation in fourth. They're hoping their team advances to the final four teams tomorrow night, which will be live from Fort Worth, will be on ESPNU. And the score is in for Lindsey Brown, an impressive 9-9-5, their high score in that rotation, and that ties her with Kyla Ross for the lead in floor exercise.